Oh, it's upset. Oh, um, it's currently half past twelve. I've stopped for a minute. I've got braver. Um, uh, today, we've got a slight change of plan. Um, cause if you remember back to yesterday's vlog, I was saying that um, I was going to get some cleaning done. That is still happening, but right now I'm out on the bike. I'm going to do my refit, grab some lunch, and then we'll start. I'll talk to you guys in a bit. Okay, you join me at five past two. Um, I'm going to take you guys up for a time lapse in just a moment. Um, I'm going to grab a quick snack and then I'm going to start. And I don't know if you have that much stuff on the shelves to actually clean up. And then we'll get on with the uh, camper. I'm trying to get that finished today and I'll try and get a low load of belt for the uh, Lego Technic um, bulldozer. Do it to you in a bit. Okay, I may it work shortly. I haven't had to start yet because uh, we Dad's been trying to fix the bathroom door. Just trying to re revive somewhat of a better word but come to the older phones. Yeah, it's fully charged. I'm meant to see if I can revive one of the other phones as well, which I'll which is completely dead. See if I can get some power into that. I need to get some power into this phone. Uh, but first, uh, I think this is juiced up to the max, but I've got not a clue how these things work. Um, because if Georgia's signal keeps coming on, and then goes off again after a little while. I'll probably try to charge these up a bit later on. Um... Yeah, I, I slept in quite late this morning because for some bizarre reason I was just so tired. I was honestly yesterday, oh, after yesterday's cycle and the route I took, I was just so tired, tired that um, I think I just crashed out. I've already been out of my cycle, done my, done my wee fit. Um, for now, I'm meant to. Head over there and crack on. I might don't know about how I'll angle with you guys yet because I don't really know whether I'm tell you on or not. Oh well we'll find out. <laughs> um but for now I meant to at least tackle the bottom two shelves and the top one. So what I'll do first is hmm. Him. Does someone do that? Right, I think I have a plan. Um, so I've got a WH Malcolm uh, Volvo FH13, I do believe. It's uh, not the same one I drive. Or used to drive. I don't really drive Volvos anymore. I well, I occasionally, I occasionally drive a four sixty, but recently I've been 
not needing it. Needing to drive a Volvo because on the Volvos there's a massive disadvantage which is there is no manual mode which is quite annoying so that's why I've gone for Merc because as far as I'm aware correct me if I'm wrong it still has what we call a manual mode where effectively you manu manually switch manually change gears normally through a uh, paddle um, on the steering column on the side can't remember fully how that works um, but yeah um, as you guys I forgot to put this in yesterday's vlog I might have put it in I can't remember um, I bought myself from the new Mercedes um, just before I got into cleaning, I'll insert them and uh, show, show you that. It's a 2017 Mercedes Benz New Actros. It's a 12 speed automatic. Um, very, very nice truck. It's a 2551 uh, mid lift. Uh, we've got some quarry work coming up. Uh, plan for that is I'm going to be taking the mid lift one. <laughs> well, I'm going to be taking two because simple reason being is that there's two sets of work. One set is lightweight stuck curtains. Well, effectively I'm sitting sit to my mid lift in short, but there is a couple of jobs which are all recrawl which will require our 4x2 Mercedes but I've put forward and I've said look I've got a mid lift I, I know that you've specifically requested to have a 4x2 because of lack of fuel and stuff but I with my Mercedes I've got uh, two fuel tanks so I don't need to worry about fuel as often and I can fill up before I come into a quarry because one of the quarries what I've been tasked to go to is a fuel station about 5 kilometers away so if I get stuck and I run low on fuel I can fill up just as I leave the, just after I leave the quarry which is quite useful Any no, ideas on what I'm drinking? And it's a hot drink. Oof, that's hot. Still a little bit too hot for my liking. That's exactly what I mean. I don't know if you guys heard that. Banning my so dad trying to fix up the door. Because for some reason it decided to jam. I'm going to see you guys up. If you guys can't be see the tally, I might check it on. See you guys up for a time lapse. Just to get these shelves tidied up. I need to readjust some of the screws. Because one of them looks fairly loose. It seems to be a back one. So I'll talk to you in a bit. Okay, just a quick little update. Um, I've just been planning out for the week. Um, Thursday, I'm doing a lot of recording. Thursday, um, well, Wednesday and Thursday, what I'm thinking of doing is reviving the Construction Simulator series. So... Thursday there will be a lot of recording out. I won't be releasing any <coughs> spanner.
Sorry, guys. Yeah, so is that all guy? Um oh. I won't be releasing any of the construction simulator series until after this lockdown series is complete. I might do I haven't quite decided yet. But certainly at the moment I won't be because um, with the construction simulator series it's quite a complex thing to edit because one of the jobs I've got coming up right, I'm going to open it quickly to make sure I've got everything I need is it's quite a complex uh, job. Well, right thing. I got told that you should upload your G27, which I'm just going to trial. Um, I'll just make sure I don't need to, uh, to install anything else onto it. Just make sure it's all working. I've got two, possibly three big jobs. When I say big jobs, I'm talking pretty much all the kit I have and to have, I will be needing sort of size job. Um, I've got a Volvo 360 25 ton machine which I prim primarily use for a lot of the stuff, so I'll be doing that, using that mainly. What I'll do if this starts to load is I'll flip you guys around and I'll show you around the uh, 360 Volvo because I think I think it's a great bit of kit. What I'll do I'll drive over to the quarry and I'll show you a little glimpse of what's coming up after this series is finally over. Um, might have some ice cream later. I've I've, had, I've ran out of and grabs a lot, but. And obviously the bite is going on massively overnight. If you remember here, I had a massive bite. And effectively it looked like I had two elbows. Well, overnight, with the help of a gold flannel, which you would have seen in yesterday's vlog, and Amphasan, which is a special bite cream. Come on, please, Lord. I'm going to use my background to some work. Um, it's gotten a lot better. It's a lot less itchy. So, that's always a bonus. Um, I have been very nicely informed about the progress on the S12. So, could be on that as early as four weeks time. I mean I've and obviously the Genona Bridge job I have thoroughly I've written on honestly I may have been moaning a bit about the work. But to be truthfully honest, it was a good job. I mean, I don't think there was many drivers that did more than 12 jobs. I mean, I was running back and forth, maybe five to six loads a day. ZOS Stepo from DSV. So, I'm just gonna grab my flask, actually, at it. 
Let's open up some charge. Put the rest in charge. Draw a shout out. Comment down below what you think I'm drinking. There you go, can't wait at people thinking. <laughs> um, so yeah, I'm going to have to record it off my phone guys, uh, because Church and Simulator Series is OBS Studio and Screencast, both of them have decided to quit working on me. I have no idea why, so I'm going to look into that as well. I'm going to wait for this to load up guys and I'll see you at the quarry. Daddy only let me drive on a dirt road Blacktop was off limits way back then I remember that first day we hit that interstate that highway got up underneath my skin and I've been rolling ever since Love to hear those big wheels whine Cause my windshield sees the world That my rear view leaves behind Shifting gears, I love that sound I top off my tanks and coffee Put the hammer right back down Yeah, this is who we are I've seen this whole country on this big road My office has one hell of a view I really like your town I'd love to stick around But I'm just a gypsy rambling Passing through Lord knows that's the truth I love to hear those big wheels whine Cause my windshield sees the world that my rear view leaves behind Shifting gears I love that sound I top off my tanks and coffee Put the hammer right back down Yeah, this is who we are And how we roll Out on the big Shifting gears, I love that sound I top off my tanks and coffee Put the hammer right back down Yeah, this is who we are